Wow. Hi, you guys. Welcome back to my channel. I'm with my mom again, and we're going to let you know what we think of Daisy Oh So Fresh. And let me start out by saying the original Daisy I despised. My mom doesn't know this story, but when I lived in Oregon, I got a sample of Daisy, smelled it, and tossed it over the balcony into the trash. Actually, I'm into the grass, but oh my God, I hated it. Really? It was horrible. But this is something altogether different. So if you didn't like Daisy, don't not try Daisy Oh So Fresh because this is the fruity version. Now, it was launched in 2011 and the main accords are fruity and sweet, green and floral, violet, powdery, fresh, citrus, and rose. It's described as a fruity floral, and the top notes are green notes, raspberry, pear, and grapefruit. The middle notes are violet, lychee, apple blossom, rose, and jasmine, and the base notes are plum, which I love, musk, and Virginia cedar. Now, when I smell it, to me, it smells like a girl, the girl next door, like a pretty girl next door. It's fruity and it's sweet, but it's not, in my opinion, a gourmand at all. Which I kind of like gourmands better that are predominantly just all food, if you know what I mean. But this definitely has some floral in it. But I think it might have more fruit than more floral. Um, Mom, what do you think about this fragrance? Do you want to smell oh, it again? Yes, I Okay, do. I'll take the lid off for you. <laughs> of course, my nail got messed up. I try to do them special, but... Oh, and let's just shout out to the bottle. It is so cute. The little lid. It's adorable. My mom's like, did it come like that? Oh, gee. I'm like, yeah, it's the um, it's the mini. So it's here you go, mom. so cute, and the lid is beautiful. Like, it's <laughs> a beautiful flower. The... Oh, this smells heavenly. It smells like the first day of spring. The first day of spring, she said. Now, do you smell any fruit at all? I smell it's just so it's hard to put my finger on what the I'm trying to smell it smell smells like but it smells gorgeous that's all I have to say about it <laughs> it's it's not strong and it's not weak and it doesn't make you sneeze it just smells so beautiful would you say this is a green fragrance I would say it's a beautiful fruit. Well, yeah, you would. It's, you said it smells like spring. It definitely has a green vibe to it, but it also has like a fruity vibe as well. Yes. So I am not a person that likes floral fragrances unless they are frangipani flowers or honeysuckle. There's just a few and far in between that I enjoy that are floral. But this, it's as like a combination of both. Now, definitely. I don't really get raspberry, and I don't get pear because I love pear. No, I don't smell um, either. I don't get grapefruit. Uh, I do get a little bit of an apple, and I do not get plum. So maybe I get a floral with an apple thrown in. Kind of comparable to Drunk on Youth by Derek Lam Ten Crosby, <laughs> I believe it's called. Um, but yeah, and I will tell you, when I called Sephora years back and I said to the girl that worked there, what fragrances can you recommend to me that are sweet and yummy? And she said, Daisy Oh So Fresh. She said she wears it every day and it smells sweet and fruity like a girl next door. So take that advice. She was very right on that. It's subtle. It does smell almost like a little girl. It's fruity, it's sweet, I love it. I'm talking too much. Out of all of them I've ever smelled, I like that the best. Oh, wow. Well, you heard it here, you guys. It's my mom's favorite so far. And let's let's do a shout out to our candle review mom we're gonna do tomorrow, which is Love. And it's by Bath & Body Works Cotton Candy Champagne. Let's see if my mom can smell it. I've already burned burned this before, so that's why it's not looking perfect, but uh, I definitely can get the cotton candy. It's so freaking awesome. I can oh, it's good. Okay, let me pass that I on to my mom. I can smell that. Okay. 
And that's the painting I do. I actually paint murals. Oh, it smells good enough to eat. <laughs> but you don't want to do that. <laughs> yeah. Hey, let's put it on our beautiful pedestal. Make it beautiful. a complete beautiful picture. So oh, so cute. Pretty. And I did get this at TJ Maxx, or it was Ross. I forget, but I just love their stuff. I could go broke in TJ Maxx. And I think this was, was this a white barn candle? Yes, it was. All right, you guys. Well, tune in. Let's do a candle video tomorrow, Mom. We're going to do this review tomorrow on Love Cotton Candy Champagne. And we hope you loved our video on Dizio So Fresh. Give it a thumbs up if you'd like. And we'll see you tomorrow.